Llévate mansión para la mesa 10 pesos. 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 Um, one of the founders of uh, Chilango, the restaurant chain, we set up Chilango because we really love Mexican food and it's um, a very exciting time uh, for Mexican food in Europe. It's very popular because it's um, fresh, simple, healthy, uh, made real food. It's very popular because it's comida fresca, simple, and casera, lo que promueve. Uh, pataya and, and with some pink grapefruit, a little bit of lime. So we, we have a cross between a green tomato and a, and a cape gooseberry. Similar. We're actually going to go to the uh, chili farm and we're going to be eating them off the, off the bush. I believe we're going to the greenhouses. Where are we going to the greenhouses? So this is a very, a very unique issue to have. Normally you have poly tunnels that keep things warm. The problem here is so hot. You have to put netting to keep it cool. <laughs> As I'm dedicated to my job here, and I've never done this, I've never had a chili off, uh, Sorry, off a tree. Off a tree, so I'm actually going to try it. Oh, yeah. It looks like a <laughs> This smart. one looks like. Really? Yeah. This looks <laughs> really. Quantos really? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> actually, it smells. It oh, smells fruity. different. It almost smells a little bit like a tomato. Yeah. Really fruity. Yeah. yeah. And here we go. Oh. oh. It's a psychological thing. Mm. Yeah, but you've bitten into the seeds. It's hot. <laughs> <laughs> now that's not sweat. Those are tears coming out of my eyes. Yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> Interesting. It's not as. No, it is as hot as I thought it was. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so fresh off the uh, Delicious off the plants. Habanero. Half eaten by Louis. Normally, um. Yeah. <laughs> You want some water? Ooh, you mm. <laughs> it is very fruity. You want yeah. fire, it, it tastes like a really ripe red bell pepper, but almost slightly sweet. <laughs> <laughs> this bit in here, the, the bit around the, the seed, membrane. a membrane is the hottest bit. You want to avoid eating that as much as possible. When it's when it's dry, we tend to scrape them out and uh, and it get the, the outside for the flavour. It's an intense. <laughs> But it's not, it's not completely unbearable like a, oh, like an Arbot or something like that. <laughs> it's a nice heat, you know, it's a nice, nice fish. No, no, actually, it's just my well, whole mouth, my yeah. whole mouth. I just feel like I've been pepper sprayed. <laughs> oh, it's got like an apple bite. It's all right. Apple bite. Yeah, yeah. I haven't got the, yeah. Okay. It gets hotter like, towards the end. Scotch bonnets, no, no way. way! Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, <laughs> it's less, the taste is not as nice, is it? It's very, um... Yeah, it, it's, it's just um, it. grassy. <laughs> it's, um... <laughs> it's being very hot. <laughs> it tastes a bit more watery. The other one has a bit more of a, a fruit flavor, like yeah, it's, it's sweet. sweet. Yes. This just tastes very, very watery yeah. and very hot. <laughs> Hello, that was very educational and very exciting, and we had some very hot chilies, and yeah. uh, we're going to punish ourselves later. Yeah. We are going to a um, chili and tomatillo production facility. And look at dry, powdered, pulped, you name it. 